skincare products from Timu and Shein. Yes, Timu and Shein. These two companies have been known for their very, very cheap products. Usually the products are not the greatest quality, but today I have some faith. I've created a system with the Timu products on this side and the Shein products on this side. And we're gonna see if I can guess which product is which just based on me touching the product and feeling the quality of the package. All right, so I've got my blindfold on and the two, we've got the, are you kidding me? <laughs> These two products are literally just in a box. How am I supposed to tell? Can I open them? Should I open them? I think we should. It's gonna be hard. How do I open this thing? Can I? Where's my knife? Found it. Still just a box, so that doesn't help anything. I got product one. And product number two. Oh, I am ripping. Wait, I have... oh, there we go. <gasps> it already came off. Wait, what the crap? Does this not like stay on? Well, that already shows you how nice it is. Oh, oh, it's one of those like, wait, it didn't even work. Okay, well, that for starters is not something that we want. Oh wait, does this one come off? Wait, oh. Okay, okay, well, I'm gonna say this one's Timu. Honestly, I think that this one was Timu. And I think that this one was Shein, because this one definitely feels a little bit better. Not sure why the cap just, you know, goes like that. So I'm gonna guess this one's Timu and this one's Shein. We got it! I got it right! Okay, that's that's not my favorite thing. Wait, was this thing not? There we go, now it works. You just had to do it a couple times. First impressions based on that, I don't like that this thing just comes off because when you're traveling, That's not exactly what you want. Although I do love the colors of both of them. Now, I am a judge a book by its cover kind of girly. I know, I know, okay? I thought we were close enough, I could tell you that. I didn't want to offend anybody, but it's true. If I don't like what it looks like from first glance, I'm not gonna read it. Or in this case, I'm not gonna buy it. So, I'm going off of first impressions. Whether the product is something that, honestly, I'd actually buy. Or, it's just a super cheap dupe that, that's all it is. So, based on first impressions, I gotta say, Shein's getting the point. Ooh, ooh, team Shein. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. Before we get further into testing all of the products, we gotta make teams. Spam the comments if you are hashtag team Shein. Or hashtag team Timu. <laughs> comments right now and by the end of this video we're gonna see which team may have won and there may be a prize so anyways time for product number two but I will tell you there is one or maybe a few products that are going to blow your mind we got product number two baby I feel like I'm some kind of superhero from one of the movies where they've got like the little tiny line okay anyways um okay we've got our two products we're gonna start out with this product. Mm. Oh, stop. Are you kidding me? What is it with these caps? Maybe the cap is supposed to be just like one of those pull off ones though. The last one sucked, but this one, okay, the bottle is like a cheap plastic. It's literally like, you can bend it. I don't know if you're supposed to be able to do that. Okay, yeah, this, this literally feels, honestly, it feels like a glow recipe dupe. This thing, I can't smell it or anything, but okay, okay, we're getting that product. Oh, oh boy, oops. <gasps> okay, ow. This is real glass. Let's see both caps. No, I'd say they're both pretty good. They've got grippage. Yeah, I don't think that's a word. Anyways, um, I just based off of this, I'm gonna say that this is obviously Timu. And this one's Shein. Did we get it right? I did! Stop, this thing, these both seem like glow recipe dupes. Literally, look at these products right here. Tell me that those are not glow recipe dupes, but specifically this one. I felt it and I was like, no, glow recipe dupe. We're gonna test them, we gotta give them a chance. The last one I didn't, so sorry about that. But 
We're gonna see if this one's actually worth it. If it ever comes out, you have to go like that. No, you shouldn't have to. It should be on the bottom. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Literally smells like the Dollar Tree um, scents that you could get it like for a perfume or something. We're gonna put it on this side of my face. Oh, ew, that's weird. Super oily. Is it supposed to be oily? This is a watermelons niacinamide serum. Gosh, even just this label literally looks so fake, but that's okay. We're gonna put on our serum. It is quite smooth, I gotta say. Oh, but I do not like that texture. It's super weird. Aren't serums supposed to usually be not lotion-y? Kind of questionable. But I will say that the, the smell is good and it does make me feel super soft. So far, this one's not looking too great. But this one, let's see. Obviously by the packaging, this stuff is legit. Now let's see, oh, this isn't interesting. I've never seen it like that. Okay, so immediately it starts to work. Ooh, I like that. It's not like got separate, it doesn't have the separation to it. This one feels super soft too. Ah, this side of my face is starting to feel sticky. This one might actually be much better. So, just based off of the test that we just did, I will say that this one is definitely a dupe fail. And this one is honestly pretty good. I mean, it's kind of making my face burn a little bit. So I think we can all agree on this one. I'm pretty sure you can agree on this one with me as well. Team Shein just won again. Team Shein for the win, my goodness. I am gonna have to start shopping on Shein and completely forgot about Timu. The blindfold is back on and we've... What the? What on earth is this? Um, so... Obviously, what the? This one's like got extra packaging. Ew, why is it so, ew, it's powdery. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, well that was easy. I don't know if that's a good sign. Whoa, I can smell it just from opening it. it smells really... <laughs> oh, I think I just nailed it. Ugh. That's interesting. And obviously I'm assuming that this is the exact same thing, but I don't like how it's already powdery. And it's also powdery. And it smells like nothing, but it smells disgusting. I don't, I don't like that smell. Based on packaging, this one obviously is bigger. It feels like a much more secure, real package or whatever you want to call it. And this one, just this, this cap is weird. And the, the package is, honestly, I can't tell very well, but this one smells a lot better. I'm gonna say that this bad boy is Shein and this wimpy boy <laughs> is Timo. Was I right? Oh my gosh, I was. Wait, what on earth are these? They're literally the same products. Look at that. Okay, so we've got Bulgarian Rose, whiten and improve skin. I don't know if I wanna whiten my skin. Function, whiten skin and make skin delicate. That's concerning. Bulgarian Rose Brightened Crystal Gel Mask. Making the skin tender and glossy. Lift and tighten intensively. Plenish water and moisturize. Okay. Are we seriously gonna try this? I need you to spam the comments and give me emotional support as I try this because uh, this is, I don't wanna whiten my face and that product just sounds really questionable. So spam the comments with go Clay, go. Go Clay, go. I can do this. Now that we've got our little bowls and the water, it is time to test it. And I'm using my handy dandy little blindfold to hold my hair out of my face and out of the way. All right, so it says that we need to mix the jelly mask and purified water until it is particle free. It didn't exactly tell me, holy crap. Wait, look at that, there's roses inside of it. That's gonna be cool. It didn't exactly tell me how much to use, so I'm gonna go with like that much maybe. This is kind of cool. This is slightly questionable. Oh my gosh, it's turning into jelly. It's a jelly mask. Oh. Now it smells weird. Someone please save me. Why am I doing this? Okay, and then it says to just immediately apply onto face. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this. I want some little rose petals. Ugh. I do not know how I feel about this. But it's good to try something new, right? Well, don't try this at home.
I will sacrifice for you. <laughs> Booty full. I like the feeling of this one. Still weird. Let's get some flower petals. This one had a good original smell to it, but now I'm really questioning. It's got like a subtle smell and I don't like it. I just wanted the petals. Ah, it's difficult. Ooh, pretty. Oh, uh, it's dripping. I don't know, super thick, but this stuff is hard to put on. We're gonna call it good. But I think you can honestly tell just from one side to the other which one it is. I think the timer has gone off. Oh. What? Whoa. Okay, they're dry. Like when you tap them, there's literally nothing on my hands. Can I actually peel it off is the question. Oh, you kind of can. Oh, wait. That is aesthetic. Wait, I love that. This might actually be a product that continues in my routine because this is kind of fun. Let's speed up this process because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be here for a while, so. All right, I ended up just having to wash the rest off because apparently you're supposed to actually put a lot more because these turn out completely solid. Although they didn't exactly tell you what it does other than white in your skin, which actually, Let's put that to the test. I mean, I could say that it kind of whitened my skin, so it didn't whiten my skin, which, thank you. Um, no one wants that, at least I don't. I think we can all say it together, say it with me. Team Sheehan won again. Sorry. And on to the next product. I love that we didn't go in order, so I'm like, obviously seruming my face and then I'm putting on a face mask and then, I don't know, doing a lip mask next. Who knows, but we'll see. Cool, cool, okay. Okay, we're evaluating currently. Oh, okay. Oops, what the crap? This is the box, the box is silky. Where's the product? <laughs> Ah, this thing forever. Okay, so it obviously already started off opened. That makes me, I can't figure out this product to save my life. What the? Okay, here we go. Anything else in the box? No. What on earth? I do, how does this, what? What is this product? There's like, I, I honestly don't know. This thing's a mess, so I'm gonna honestly go with this was from Timu. And this was from Shein, maybe? I was. I was wrong. Oh my gosh, my face has never felt softer. Okay, I didn't know that there was a brush on this thing. I was like, why is it? Oh, I should have taken it off and then I would have felt that there was a brush. Dang it! Okay, so I guess Timu got a point for that. This is from She Glam? Okay, wait, isn't She Glam like a really nice company? I feel like I've seen that She Glam is like super great. Obviously, just from starters. I mean, it was difficult to understand, but I do love the concept now that I've opened it and I'm giving the point to Shein. I keep mixing them up. But, time for the trusty, dusty, blindfold turned headband. Okay, so we've got a Japan Sakura, 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 Sakura cleanser. Soften skin, deep cleansing and moisturizing, and it's cute and pink. And then we've got this. How does this even work? We're gonna need that so we don't have to go to the bathroom and do it. I'm assuming that you squeeze it. <gasps> wow, okay. Oh, I love this. I love this already. I only had to do one squirt, and it is taking care of the rest. I just love that it has a built in brush because I don't usually. It was fizzy. Um, I don't usually use a brush, so it just being built in with a brush is honestly super nice. 10 points for that one, having this little brush in on it. Now let's try this. Ooh, that feels weird. It feels weird with all the bubbles like crackling, but part of the experience. Let's see what you got, little guy. That's weird. It's like airy. Oh, it even like looks kind of like airy. I don't know how else to explain that. I don't like this so far. Smells good though. It smells like a plant. And it is very soft. You know what we could do? Let's try to use this here too. Okay. It is pretty soft and it laver lathers on. Honestly, I'm torn. I could, ooh. No, this side's starting to sting a little. Uh, yeah, okay. No, hold up, hold up. Okay, I've gotta say, this side is honestly feeling quite irritated. 
I do not like the feeling of that. Whether, why does my face look so weird? Sorry, Timo, but she and won again. This stuff just made me feel a lot better. I love that it had a brush on it as well. I mean, a pretty simple request, just please don't make my face feel like it's burning and like rashing and stuff, because that side definitely did. So let me hear it from ya. She yin, she yin. Yep, she and won again. Okay, where are the products? Let's get going on the products. Is this the product? Ooh, she is in terrible condition. Where's the product? Oh, what the? Oh, okay, okay. What on earth? What on earth is this? It's like a popsicle? Nope, no it's not. That is not popsicle lollipop, nothing like that. We're gonna have to let that one sit. We're gonna have to think about that one for a bit. Where's the? This one came in a plastic bag. So it's a plastic bag and inside the plastic bag is the actual product. Oh, okay. I think I know what this is. Either this is gonna be kind of a like milky watery style lotion or this is a lip balm. And this seems just weird. Like I hate that it's got like this divot in it and stuff. Comes off easy. Okay. Ooh, it smells like a fruit. Ooh, okay. Okay, wait, I can't try it yet. Um, I'm gonna guess, okay, well, this one, obviously, I mean, okay, the package was, I think I just lost it. The package was in terrible condition. It was such a cute idea, though, and I gotta say, unless the package just broke from it dropping on the floor, this just feels like a cheap material. Like, this is literally, it's like this big, and it has, it honestly feels like they personally stuck on the sticker around it. I'm gonna say that this is Timu, and wherever the other one went is Shein. Was it correct? Let's go! Another one, another one. Whoa, this is super interesting. Yeah, tell me that you can't find this at like the dollar store. I understand now why it fell. Are these lip masks? Lip balms? Yeah, this thing looks so fake. You can't even, oh, here we go. Like the little tiny, the actual label for it is like this big, it's like lip mask. And then it's like, caution, caution, caution. This is fake <laughs> Just kidding. But what are we here to do? We're here to, you know, test it. So that, I wish you could see that even closer. Like if you like look super close, it looks super fake. Okay, let's try it though. Remember when I said I judge a book by its cover? Just because I already know that it's from Timu, my expectations are already super low. I think for the next one, I need to try it and then figure out if it's Timu or Shein. Smells good, but it does not feel good. That is the cutest concept I have ever seen in my life. And low key, I wanna make some that look like a honeycomb. That is cute. It smells pretty good. It's hard to like, not a lot comes out of it. So you gotta like, that is interesting. This stuff is way thicker. Like, I feel like I'm eating a lip smacker. Ugh. The taste, the the smell of it is like turning into taste and getting in my mouth. This side was also super sticky though. Can I just do a draw? I mean, honestly, the idea and concept of this, super cute. It's really hard to take out and actually apply it. Not to mention it doesn't feel like it's there. Unless this stuff is just absolutely overwhelming and like the only thing I can think about and feel is this. So, you know what? We're gonna give no point to either because I don't recommend either of those. Our last and final product. We've already gone through the cleanser. We've gone through the serum. We've gone through the, have we gone through the toner yet? Honestly, we've gone through everything. So I'm assuming that these are, this is the toner. Anyways, we're gonna start off with this one. What the, I'm so confused. Okay, here we go. Ugh, ugh. I didn't even eat it, I didn't lick it, nothing. And those lip balms have just like gone completely, ugh, they are so gross. Okay, anyways. Whoa, okay, this is like a nice bottle. Does this come off? Ooh, and it actually like get on and off the cap, so. You know, I could like enter into one of those contests, be like unwrapping everything, wrapping everything blindfolded. 
here we go. Um, I have to actually test each of these products and then decide which is which. Oh, wait. Wait, is this the cap? Okay, so for starters, it's like not the best cap also. Okay, so you keep it upside down. Where's the other one? Okay, here's this one. This is obviously a really nice, oh crap, uh, bottle. This one I don't like, so let's try this. Wait, is there a cap? No, okay. Okay, I think that they just, oh, here we go. They did not want us to be trying this product. For starters, it doesn't smell like anything. Oh, it is just water. This stuff is literally water. I'm gonna just put it on my cheek, only because that's the only area that I can. There's literally nothing here. There we go. Okay, it doesn't smell anything like anything. So I'm honestly thinking that this one, where did it go? Oh, here we go. This one is a Shein, and that this one is Timu. Does it squirt out? Oh, it's a toner, and you're supposed to like pump it out. Ooh, it smells really good. That was a bad idea. Wow, either I burnt my face or that, those products have been just ruining my face on this side. Um, Honestly, I liked that this one smelled good, but the packaging, the packaging just felt super cheap. So I'm gonna go with, this one was Timu and this one was Shein. I am shocked. This was the Shein product and this one was Timu? This one, this was a Timu product. This almost looks like in, the original dupe. That's kind of a cute casing and it's watery. I did like the idea of this being a spray bottle. I guess for me, felt like it was a Timu product. Alrighty then. Well, after much thought and testing and a little bit of suffering, but it's fine, I think we have our winner. To all of my Team Machine. We won, we won, we won. I honestly had no idea which one was gonna be better assume that Shein would be a little bit better just because Timu, but honestly, I wasn't for or against either one. So, looks like Shein products tend to have a little more reliability versus these uh, Timu products. Although, some of them did really surprise us. So, I guess it's time to not walk, but literally run to Shein to go and get more products because they've honestly got some really great stuff. Bye! And don't forget to be a sweet one and go and check out this video. Go and spam the comments, girl squad rules, so that I know that you're coming from this video and I will talk to you there.